Hi guys! Well, so what makes this... I don't know that I should start looking at you. I'm just gonna look at you. <laughs> We're gonna edit this bit out. What, what's my next question? Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Backstage with Brenna. My name is Brenna and we're backstage. Today I'm here with a very special guest here to talk about his capstone project. Give it up, ladies and gentlemen, for Irie Evans! <laughs> so Irie and I have been in no, I feel like a number of shows together. Has there only been one, really? Really? Just Life is a Dream? Maybe I, I take it back. We've been in one show together. Um, but I am so happy to have him, you. I am so happy to have you here. So what is your capstone? What are you doing for it? So my capstone is an original play I wrote called Too Good. I got the idea for this uh, play in high school, um, but I you know, started writing it um, in my playwriting classes with Young Jing Lee. Mm -hmm. And now I'm directing it this quarter, so... Oh my gosh. Yeah. I didn't know you were also directing it. Mm -hmm. So you wrote it, you're directing it, and you've been working on it for years. So how does it feel to like have it be happening now? It's, you know, a little wild, honestly, because, you know, to take the script and then put it on stage with real actors and real bodies, and, you know, this week we're going into tech and all that, so... It's really wild to see all these elements come together from something that really just started in my head. Yeah. Um, why did you decide to do this project as your capstone? So I sort of knew as soon as I declared theater that this was going to be my capstone. Wow, long range vision. Yeah. Okay. It was just this golden opportunity to be like, hey, I'm going to revisit this work that I started yeah. and I'm going to pursue it. And by the time I graduate, I will put it on as a full production. Yes. So the play is loosely based on my coming out experience. Okay. Um, so I came out to my school my junior year of high school. Okay. And along with that came, you know, a lot of... It was, it was really just a journey of self-exploration -ex um, and owning my identity. Mm -hmm. But, you know, with that, you know, came some more difficult things, some tragedies, some, a lot of pain, but also a lot of beauty. I'm really happy with what the play has become, mm -hmm. and it means so much to me, and it means so much to me to be able to tell this story, a black queer story that we rarely see on stage. Mm -hmm. Irie, another question for you. What makes this project like a culmination of your artistic and academic endeavors here at Stanford? So I'm actually on the acting track. I'm in the acting concentration oh, okay. uh, in TAPS. Yeah. But, you know, I've taken classes in playwriting. I've taken classes in directing. For me, this is, you know, my time to be in the driver's seat. Mm -hmm. I'm no longer an actor. I am now, you know, in charge of this whole production. And it's sort of a wild feeling, but one I feel really prepared for mm -hmm. because, you know, in my playwriting classes, I was able to develop the script yeah. in a workshop style and receive feedback and whatnot and really just develop the story um, using the input of my peers, which helped me gain an insight into what makes a story work and what makes a story not work. You know, through my directing classes and my work with other directors, I have been able to, you know, craft my own directing style. Yeah. And, and so that's why this capstone for me is like a culmination of everything I've been learning over my time in TAPS. You know, it's, it's really allowed me to explore the various different aspects of theater, you know, te theatrical techniques, um, directorial strategies yeah. and whatnot that I've been exposed to over my time yeah. um, in the theater department. So it's really a great opportunity to finally apply all of these skills that I've learned. Well, thank you so much for being here, Irie. It has been a true pleasure. This has been another episode of Backstage with Brenna. Tune in next time to hashtag Get, Get Peer Advised. advised.